Baby, you could keep me going Cause you've been everywhere Let me take up all the love you're showing I need it more than air And you know that I've been suffocating You could be the one to help But my issues are nauseating I don't wanna bring you down I just wanna be free from the free Feel love for the first time I just wanna love something about me See something to open my eyes Don't wanna be the only one with a house key Have something I'm proud of I wish we were living in my dreams Cause in another world you go Pencil na sinarpen ng Dean namin So I got it from Bijan's Yang tagal namin di nagkikita <laughs> Ngayon home now on the way to the testing site is me with my mask and my shield GM we need to new era that's where we're gonna have our exam so yeah ah, let's do this guys <laughs> day 2 of the exam. Anyway, it's super early. It's just 6 a.m. Wala pang tao at all. Ako lang gusto sa classroom. Sobra aga ko. So, this is our classroom. It's in the era. Yeah. Wala ang tao. Me lang muna. So, bawal phones and bawal notes after. So, since wala pa naman and everything, pwede pa magbasa. Pero later, when the proctor is in, we have to put our belts in front. And then, bawal na talaga mag-aral. Yung nga sa phone. So, naka-off yung cell phone ko the entire time. Okay, guys. Second day done. Oh my gosh, I have mask ni na. Char mask ni. <laughs> anyway, pagod pa din si Te. So, I will just take a nap. And then, aral na ulit. So, yun yun. And thank you for always being there. Gabi, every step of doon doon siya. Pati sa pag-prepare ng sandwich and everything. Sa water, lahat complete. So, thankful and grateful. Sleep muna. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ooh, okay. So this is it, guys. Um, we're down to the not the day before, the second, the last day before the the second set of the exam. So clinicals na yon. So we're gonna start with pharma, um, IM, and then surgery. So usually, kasi five days yung break niyan in between, but for our batch, three days in between lang. So, we have so much um, things to study, so much material to study, but with so little time. Kasi, honestly, nung part kasi na, nung nagpalapit na yung first set of subjects, medyo hindi na namin, or in my case, but for the people I've also talked to, hindi na nila nabalikan yung second set of subjects kasi nga nag-focus na sa mga basics. Kasi, six subjects din yun. So, yung last like, yung week before nung first um, set of subjects, nag-focus na talaga kaming lahat dun sa first set of subjects. So, hindi na muna namin naisip yung mga second set of subjects kasi nga, we had to focus on the first set. So, right now, since three days lang yung interval, parang ang hirap. <laughs> Mga gonna lie, it's hard. Anyway, so since three days lang yung in-between, parang dami kaya coverage ng clinicals, to be honest. <laughs> So, parang pinag-compress lahat. As in, hindi mo talaga mabalikan lahat. And as much as I wanna read everything, lahat ng clinical is hard to read everything. And because they ask something, and the question kasi they ask sometimes in the exam, are like pure recall, and kung hindi mo balikan, minsan, oh shucks, you're da. Kung four choice yan, minsan na you're left with two. And so, you really have to like read. So, yung binalikan kong handout talaga, na binasa ko from start to finish ulit, is pharma. So I'm reading it. Ang hirap. Kasi when you say you're given only 3 days, minsan parang 2 days lang yan. Kasi nga, tomorrow is gonna be the day before the exam. So, of course, you have to sleep early. So I decided that tonight, I am gonna do an all-nighter. Not a pure all-nighter, but like, I'm gonna stay up really late. So I'll try to sleep around 4 a.m. On the sacrifice na lang. So I'm gonna do that sacrifice. Usually kasi, since the start of studying, I always stay up like around two or three but this time until stay up until four and parang pinagsama ko na talaga lahat ng subjects together so today i 
I studied three subjects. Sometimes it's hard because it's too much information. And sometimes you just wish that you could just put it all in your head. And I wish that too. <laughs> it's already 11, 12. So I will continue on studying. And we're going to do this all nighter, guys. So yeah. Guys, so it's the last day. Just arrived sa um, new era. So I'm going to go down now. Thank you. So we have no one. So this is Paul's board space. I haven't vlogged after the boards, so I thought that I would start vlogging again today. So we're actually going to Padre Pio today. We just heard mass at James Place. Nag Saint Jude kami na mass online lang, and then after that, we're gonna go right now to Padre Pio sa my Eastwood. I'm just gonna light a candle, and James gonna go with me, and then we're gonna go buy Christmas gifts for my parents because I'm gonna fly home back to Idigan next week. So, yeah, I'm excited to see my family. I haven't seen them for a very long time. These are gifts for Jam's side of the family. And it's the barrier. There's are for my side of the family. Since I've been cleaning up, I also saw my previous test papers. These are my test scores from previous quizzes. Guys, this was for histology module. Oh my gosh, 2016 pa. I drew this of the adrenal gland, the thyroid gland, and the pituitary gland. And then we color it. So this was me coloring the brachial plexus. So today another documentation day. Okay, I'm in Jem's house right now and yesterday I was supposed to vlog but my anxiety was so high up. High up above and so I didn't have any energy to do anything at all. Today I have a lot of things to do. I have to finish packing because I'm flying home on Saturday na. And I also need to do some content because <laughs> of the brands that I have partnered up with. I wasn't able to do the content for them since I was busy with um, the boards and stuff. So I have to do the content now. There are still deliveries coming um, until Thursday tomorrow and maybe until Friday. I don't know. But if ever it's gonna arrive later than Saturday, Papa LBC ko nga jam. But today we have some food. So this is from a shop on Instagram. And she was so kind enough to send me their cinnamon rolls. Wow! Guys, it's so good. Ito yun. Ito yung cinnamon rolls that she sent me. Ah. Also did the Litter of Light challenge. It's a challenge wherein you actually give and create light for children. Not just children. For communities that need light. And it's solar paneled. So it's really good. They don't need like electricity. just need the sun. Yeah, I'm waiting for my COVID test. Because I'm waiting for the results. And then I'm going to buy my plane ticket tonight. I'm scheduling it for Saturday. So I'm excited to go home. But I'll still be on quarantine. So all the videos that I have 
for you guys will be edited during this quarantine period where I'm stuck at home. Look what just arrived. So this is from Manila Toy Box. Thank you so, so much. This means the world to me because I've never had anyone make me some form of a Lego. And no, you guys are very, very talented and I'm grateful for all of you guys. For those who make art of me and stuff like that, thank you so much. You warm my heart. Oh my god, it's me. And you know guys, that is really the color of my stat, like legit. Thank you, that is super cute. You guys should check out Manila Toy Box. They create things like this. Look, it's Legos and they're made beautifully and it's inside an acrylic box. You can actually display it. It's gonna go on my display. Thank you so much. Awesome. Cheesecake. Ube! Ube cheesecake. 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 Ube chees
Dumating niya siya kahapon. Sobrang sakto lang. It's like a sign na MD. So, let's open this one and let's blow up the balloon. So, we're gonna do some festivities today. Kasi I'm gonna fly back home na kasi sa Saturday. So, that means I'll be back with my family. So, for now, I'll celebrate with Gemini's family. Kasi we're also a big part of this um, journey. So, let's open the balloon and pop it up. Not pop it up. Blow it up. <laughs> let's blow the balloon um, ito lang yung nakita kong dress na yellow. Kasi I already packed. So, ayaw ko na guluhin yung other things na pinak ko. So, ito na muna yung sinuot kong dress. Medyo masikip na siya. But okay lang. Sige, let's go and blow up this balloon. Ayan. Eh, pili din ng cups. No. So we got them empty balloons. Mama, na kung picture. Kain mo na. I'm so hungry. Start. Okay, I'm gonna turn on the line. Kita ko sa inyo guys yung mga stuff that I have. These are the notebooks that I used. This looks empty, but yeah. So, ito yung mga notes ko sa pharma. Ito yung maginamit ko for review. I wasn't able to like fully show this to you guys. But yeah, these are my review notes. Also, these are my other notes. Ayan. This one is like a better notebook. Kasi mas naayos ko yung pagkasulat ko. They're all from videos and stuff. Kasi gumawa ako ng sarili kong notes. Tapos, ito yung mga um, also mga other things. Mga handouts and stuff, mga table. And these were my review books. BRS Anatomy. Yeah, binasa ko din tong BRS Anatomy ng first um, few months. This Robbins. This BRS Facial. And also read this. So, and this is Schwartz. I also read this. Binasa ko to. Ito na like ubusin lahat. But sobrang haba niya. So, hindi ko to natapos. But those were the things that I used to study. It's all in GM's place because I'm trying to clean up the house. These are the rosaries that I got from my sisters. This was the bag that I used for the entire um, exam. This long champ bag has been with me for a very long time. This is actually a hand-me-down from my mom. But I consider it a very lucky bag. And I had a lot of candies. I don't know if you guys know this candy, but it's fresh. This is my favorite candy ko since bata ako. Rosary. I had a rosary inside my bag all the time. And of course, yung mga important stuff, which is yung Noah, yung Noah's of Admission. And I also got some Watsons na wet wipes. My watch. Also, this were Skittles. Kasi yung buong breakfast ko and everything were prepared for by Jem's family. So, they gave me Skittles. Imagine mo his dad would give me Skittles the entire time. Like, apat or tig lilima kada review. And yeah, I had a lot of Skittles. My friends thought I was sponsored. I'm not sponsored by Skittles, but I'm sponsored by Jem's dad with Skittles. So, thank you, Tito. The notice of admission. So, this is a very important document. You have to bring it around with you even after the board exams are done. These are my pencils. Dapat kasi as much as possible. No, not as much as possible. Dapat talaga. Like, see-through lahat na mga dala nyo. So, all my pencil cases were see-through. This one is also see-through. Or like, yeah, it's plastic envelope. So, I had pencils. These were the pencils that I got. Yung iba nga dito, hindi pa na ano eh, sharpened. But the pencil that I used was only one. This one only. This pencil. This pencil was actually sharpened by the Dean of UST. Thank you, Doc. And the others are extra pencils. Yung iba kasi, they had a thing na i-break daw nila yung pencil. But I thought, I didn't want to break mine. Because it's sayang yung pencil and you know, maybe I can pass it on to another person. So I want to end the vlog here. This celebratory kind of day. Like finding out I passed the board exam. I really wanted to like make a special vlog about it. In a way na it was post-PLE. Because actually iba yung feelings when I was reviewing. And when it was after the exam. Um, while I was reviewing, I had a lot of anxiety, but at the same time, also, I wanted to do a lot of things. So, the anxiety was there, but the effort to study was also there. So, there were two things, and I barely slept. <laughs> Honestly, I barely slept. But it was worth it. I na lang, onti na lang, like one month to really prepare for this. Kahit hindi ako matulog ng maayos, at least it's gonna be worth it. And it was worth it talaga. Kasi yung first few days after natapos yung exam, 
it wasn't as you know, it was more of like an excitement like uh, relief from pagod and everything so i spent most of my days watching netflix lying down ganon, and eating and it was more of a relief and i didn't think much about the results yet because it was like the first two days and they didn't really re release results within those days lalo na because of covid but when this week came I knew it was going to come out eventually and because they posted they were going to release this week. PRC does not like actually tell you what it will come out. So last night I was caught off guard and the moment I opened Facebook Messenger, I saw the congrats and there I knew it was done. And, like doctor nan. I was so overwhelmed last night. I couldn't really contain all my emotions, but now I'm more calm and everything. And medyo nagising na talaga sa akin na, oh my gosh, this is really the start of it. Kasi I mean, I'm done with the med school journey part of everything, you know. But again, medicine is a lifelong journey, so just the start of everything. Just wanna tell you guys whatever you wanna um, pursue in life, keep on pushing. Pray for it also. Like, work hard, pray hard, and at the same time, just keep on believing in yourself, and it will come true. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next video which i'm super excited to share with you guys because that is probably the bulk of my entire ple journey which i really want to share with you guys love you all